Hi friends and welcome back to Pong. This is One Piece Burning Blood with Jacob doing a Nami how-to and my gosh could her boobs get any bigger. Ooh. I mean not like ooh, but like I'm like Whoa. Anyway. <laughs> Alright, we'll just jump right into this. Alright, so here is Nami's smashing X combo. Which by the way, while you do literally everything with her, her boobs jiggle. I don't know if you noticed that as much as I did or not, but it happens. Okay, so we did that, and so now here's the Y combo, which, well, it's not really anything. <laughs> See, Nami is a, I believe she's a technical character. Golly, do you see it too? Okay, good. So, anyway, <clears throat> she's a technical character, so she... She doesn't have like a common move set like the other characters that I've showed off so far where you can pretty much just mash buttons and it's all an attack. You actually have to think about what you're doing and when you're doing it. And so hitting Y while you're on the ground does nothing. Now then, uh, back X is a little smack back like that. And so now we'll go to the jumps. So jump X, you do a, um, I guess it's a fire tempo. By the way, she calls everything. It's either a tempo or some kind of weather egg, stuff like that. So there's fire tempo. Um, I believe this is just some kind of air tempo, which is a jump Y, where she kind of spears them. Which that you need to be careful of because it's... I've noticed that like it, just, it doesn't go out very far. It goes more down. So you kind of got to catch them in the right spot. Otherwise, you end up missing like that. Okay, so now that we've done that, let's, um, let's try out guard breaks. So XA, light guard. Ooh, some nice air burst going on there. And now let's do heavy. <laughs> I like that. It's a nice stun that I think they got from the um, from the show where she's basically like whooping up on all the guys for um, for basically ogling over her. She's got a funny intro um, at one point, depending on who you talk to, where she says uh, something about, do you want to come and fight me or something like that? I've already got the sexual harassment case all set up or something like that. Oh, it's crazy. Nami is a, oh, woo. She's a character. Anyway, okay, so now that we've done those, I'm going to show you the dashes real quick first. So um, she runs around like this. She doesn't do anything extra special attack-wise. But her movement that she does is a mirage tempo. So that allows her to move out of the way pretty quickly. And I think she may even get a few seconds of invulnerability from that. Or, well, you know, a split second, like as she activates it. So we're definitely going to find out, though. I'm going to try and show it off. Okay, so now we'll move on to the specials, where the X is just, you know, that same, that uh, wicked thundercloud right there um, that goes in and strikes them. And then we've got, okay, here's the weather egg, which is your uh, unique crap, which is your unique special. Now, it goes a certain distance, so you actually kind of have to time it right. Ah, oh, and he's still not under it. In order for it to work, the egg has to end up right above them. Why is it not doing it? There it goes. Okay, yeah, yeah. So, and I think it's kind of like a trap so that if they walk under it too, um, yeah, yeah, it pretty much waits for them and it'll it'll keep zapping them. <laughs> so let's get him out of that. Okay, I, I did not do that right in order to get him out. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> okay, so there's that one. And then there's also the um, thunder trap. So you send out those and um, your opponent can walk into them or they kind of slowly drift. Okay, but here's the cool thing. So you do Thunder Trap, and now you use your Y. <laughs> and they all home straight for the enemy pretty relentlessly. It's nice, I love it. Okay, so let's build our gauge back up really quick. Oh yeah, and there's the there was the Dash X, by the way, where she kind of rushes forward and, um, and hits him. Okay, so our gauge is now up. So let's do it, and then we'll do a little button mashing to see if anything's changed, which it hasn't, if I remember right. Oh my gosh, there's a fish. 
Okay, do some of that, some of that, some of that. Okay, now we're gonna try for the ultimate here. We're gonna see how it lands. Do weather egg, pop. Okay, yeah, so this one, I believe, <clears throat> it's one of those that it homes in wherever they're standing. So it doesn't actually matter where you shoot it from. You can do it from anywhere and it'll go to their position, but they can dodge it. Like it's not that it's impossible. So be wary of that. Okay, and so now I think we're ready for, um, we're ready for online ranked. Let's go. Okay, and we found a match. Now, some of you might notice I have one more support than I have in the previous episodes. The reason for that is because um, each person kind of has like a bounty on their head. And when you go into online ranked or certain modes, I guess, you actually have a... Um, you actually have a certain amount that you can't surpass. And so in the previous ones, because of my lineup... I couldn't have another support because the bounty was just too high. But this time Nami's bounty is lower than the characters I've had before. So um, it'll be a little easier to do. Let's see if I can... Oh, I'm... Ah! Ooh, <laughs> I'm actually not doing half bad, I just realized. <laughs> Maybe I should do this more often. Ooh, no, oh gosh, oh he got me, oh no, oh. <sighs> I got cocky is what I did. And that is not a good thing with, um, against a Luffy. As relentless as some of those attacks are. <laughs> as you can see, this guy, this guy means business. <laughs> So we'll just bring business right back to his door with Marco. Come on, Marco, get him. Get him, get him, get him, get him. I'm gonna, I'll try to do more stuff with Nami, but like, like I said, Luffy is just so aggressive that <laughs> I don't think I would have survived. I don't think I would have gotten as lucky as I had before. Um, Okay, 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 okay. Whew. Yeah, I'm probably gonna save Nami for um, his third character, just because um, even though I'd like to use her for more, like I just don't, I just don't feel like I have the capability to do it against against a full health ace. Um, I feel like I can say that because... Because Nami is not... Um, oh, this dude... <laughs> he's, just, he's just waiting. <laughs> um, because Nami is just... She, she doesn't have any kind of types at all. Like she is, uh, she has no hockey and she has no devil fruit is what I'm, is what I'm trying to get out. Um, oh gosh, okay, hold on. I just realized I was messing up the combo. Oh wow, that actually worked really well. Oh, oh, I forgot Luffy's still alive. Oh, <laughs> I have to say that worked out a lot better than I thought it did. What I was trying to get out before that I just couldn't because I was so focused on not jumping into um, room is um, Nami has no types, no devil fruit, no hockey. So you have to be extremely careful when fighting characters like Ace, who's a Logia type, because she has no way to bust through that other than the heavy guard break, 
which we know takes a little bit of time to bust through. But uh, yeah, so there's some good gameplay for you of Nami. And some. I, I definitely hope you can use some of this, because <laughs> frankly, I'm proud of myself if I do say so myself. And I'm not going to lie, I constantly get hypnotized by, by the size of her bust. I'm sorry. <laughs> I am terribly, terribly sorry. But I have to say it. <laughs> it's a weakness of mine. <laughs> so anyway, <laughs> like, comment, and subscribe for more One Piece Burning Blood how-tos on Pong with Jacob. <sighs> Bye, everybody.